I want your wife. Want your wife to stay away from my husband. S. X what? S. I will kill her and feed her flesh to the vultures. I cannot stand any woman who has got an eye on my husband. Not even your wife, Ugoma. Want her. Want her. Oh. ever gained a sexual satisfaction from any maiden in this land the way you do get from me that sometimes you feel like telling me i don't understand i did today you did yes with udemba what you did what Tell me my husband. Oh, I'm sorry, my love. But you see, I like seeing you smile. Anyway, that's by the way. My love, I should have informed you earlier. I want to go to the next village to see a friend. And I will be back before the nightfall. Okay, my husband, no problem. Just take good care of yourself, eh? Sure, I will. That's my love. Um, don't forget to get something from your wife and your back. I would do just that. That's my love. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my child. The moon that lighting up my darkest night. You are so bright and beautiful. Whenever you appear, Darkness gives way. I love you so much. Just leave me alone. Me? Yes. What have I done? What kept you? I've been waiting for you here for a very long time. I'm sorry, my love. I have to leave the house carefully so that my wife won't start suspecting. Please, forgive me. I missed you so much. Ugoma Ugoma 
Ugo! Oh, hola. Uh, Ugo mom went to her maternal home. Oh. But I told her I would be coming. Oh. Maybe it escaped her mind. Alright. I'll be leaving. And why are you staring at me like that? Me? Is that you? No, I should be asking you that. Okay. I'll be leaving then. No, I am not leaving. You leave. I should leave? Mm -hmm. This is my house. That's true. I will sit and wait for her then. Okay. Go and get me water. Water? Okay. I don't need it. Why? Oh, go. Sit down. I want to talk to you. Sit. I'm seated. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I'm Ali Cham. You see, you are so sweet. Sweeter than honey. And you were strong. Stronger than the strongest. In fact, you are the true definition of a real man. <sighs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Marry me. Yes. Marry me and make me your second wife. But you're married. Fiaqua. Living with my fellow woman. Is that what you call marriage? How do you mean? He's not a man. Okay. A man who cannot make his wife feel good or even make her pregnant. Is that only a man? Look, Mogu is important. I regret ever getting married to him. <laughs> but it's not your fault. I told you to wait for me to come back. But you refused and went ahead and married him. Now you are regretting. Anyway, I have to be my way now. My wife must have been worried by now. You want to make me feel jealous now, Okuya? Okay? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. No, Ugo, stop. We are outside. Eh? Hi, Otom. Mwabu Soma. Eh? See, I never want to ever, ever lose the sight of you. Not even for one second. Holido, I love you. I love you so much. I love you too, Mwabu. But we cannot turn back the hands of time. Hola. Oh, stop it. Stop. So much is it now? Hmm? You know I can never get enough of you. I know. But your wife. How's it done, my friend? It's very fine. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Nne. Yeah, you are back? Yes. Um, I was actually asking your husband about yes. you. How are you? I'm fine. I went to see my mother. Yes, he said that. How is she? She's doing very well. Thank you. All right. Um, I actually wanted to discuss something with you, but that will be next time because my husband will be waiting for me. 
Hi Zudemba. He's very fine. He sends his regards to you. Alright. My greetings to him too. Okay. I will be on my way now. is getting married to the wrong man. Hmm. My everyday prayer to the gods is that I just don't want to marry a man that will take me as his priority. But a man that will never cheat on me. A man that will love me and cherish me. Hey. Really, I want to marry a good man. Really? <laughs> hey, wait, <laughs> wait, let me ask you one question. Are you a good woman? Eh? Yes, because it's only a good woman that will pray to the gods to give her a good man. Eh? I am a good woman. You a go good woman. I am a good woman. I'm <laughs> one of the best maids in this <laughs> land. <laughs> Why are you coughing? <laughs> Do you need water? Do I need water? Hmm? As if if I want water now, you will give me. Do you have water here? Eh? Do I need water? Please let's go, Joe. Good woman. <laughs> Let's go now. Greetings to you, my husband. Welcome. Where are coming from? I'm very sorry, my husband. I was bored at home, so I decided to visit Ugoma, my friend. You, you mean you went to Ugoma's house? Yes, my husband. Any problem? Mm -mm. Not at all. What of my friend, Wago? Um, I guess he should be fine, though I didn't meet him at home. And Ugoma? She's fine. I've been with her since morning, and she sends her greetings to you. My husband, is anything the matter? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. Have you had anything to eat, my husband? Not really. As I'm talking to you now, the worms inside my stomach are already gagging up against me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my husband, yeah. let me quickly prepare something for you. Yeah, no problem. You mean you went to Goma's house? Yes, my husband. Any problem? Not at all. Aledo, you and I know that you are lying. I was with Ugoma earlier today. And you came in not quite long ago I and Ugoma departed. Let this not be what I'm thinking. I'm back. Hmm. 
Hola. Hola, go. I want to go to the room. Hola, go. Hola. Hola, go. Even what I asked her to do for me, she didn't do it. Where could she have gone to? Please leave me alone. Ego. Don't tell me you're still angry over what happened yesterday. Why won't I be angry? Why? No, tell me. Have I ever mocked you or insulted you the way you did on that day? No, now. Eh? You know I was only joking with you. Eh? That joke was too expensive. It was too serious. I said to myself that I will never have anything to do with you again. Uh -uh. Seriously. It has not got into that now. Eh? All right, see, I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. See, I will make your hair five different times to show you how sorry I am. Are you sure? I'm sure. Why well, you know? Come on, start. No problem. I will do it. But wait. Have you heard the letters? No. What is it? Guma! That stupid woman. That stupid woman. Goma. Goma. Come up here. Goma. Over. What is it? Now you tell me. Who is responsible for that pregnancy you're carrying? Hey, pregnancy qua. No, I'm not pregnant. Too. If I thought I'm pregnant, you are responsible. Oh, are you not my husband again? Have you to be sleeping with me? Haven't I been sleeping with you? Now you tell me, when was the last time I slept with you? Yeah. I can't remember, but for pregnant, I'm not pregnant. That's just the fact. Let's assume it's true. Let me assume it's true. Because if I find out you're pregnant, Goma, if I found out you're pregnant, I swear by the gods. I swear by the gods! I will kill you. I will kill the bastard who's responsible for your pregnancy. Nonsense. Am I really pregnant? When was the last time I miserated? Hey, I've not seen the one of this month. And it's two weeks gone already. Does it mean? I'm pregnant. Oh, no, 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 no. No, it can't be. Oh. Hey, I think I need to see Mama immediately. I need to see her.
is no longer in use that the seed that planted in you has started growing how did you know a good farmer up to now when the crops he planted in his farm start germinating so are you a good farmer yes of course and you're my farmland the seed is in you so i start trying to do He's doing well. <laughs> no, 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 no. She's doing well. No, I want a he. And I planted a she. All right, time will tell. Yeah. Why the long face? I'm scared. About what? My husband. I don't know how he gets to know that I'm pregnant. And he knows he's not his child. So what do we do now? I don't know. I'm as confused as something. It's okay. I don't know. Um, I will see you tomorrow. I have to go and take off what to do. Okay, but please, come up with a better idea. Trust me. I love you so much. I love you more. Goma! You and I know that I am not responsible for that thing you're carrying there. Please mind you that I'm carrying a child, not a thing. Eh? Fine. Who is responsible? Who got you pregnant? What kind of question is that? Or isn't that thing in between your legs functioning anymore? Watch it, woman! Watch it! I asked you for the last time. Who made you pregnant? I did. What? I made her pregnant. Goma, is that true? Yes. yes. And how dare you? How dare you, Demba, cultivate on my homeland? I ask you! That is because I'm a good farmer. You think I don't know what is going on between you and my so-called wife? How you have been sleeping and messing around the whole village with her? I know all that. This is my real wife. And I have come to take her home. Remember you lie! I say you lie! I did it. You can as well go and bring all the home. Because she's all yours. Yes. So that you can go ahead and build for yourself a childless home. Gamer. Yes. That is exactly what you get when an impotent man meets a barren woman. You go. Let's go. Go to bed. She dare not step out of this place. She is my legal wife. And she's going with me. Let's see. Huh? Yes. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. Aledo. Aledo. Yes, my husband. My husband, what happened to you? I had a fight. With who this time? Morgo. Why? Is it about me? Are you having anything to do with him? No, not at all. So how do you mean? My husband, I know how much you love me and I know how far you can go just to defend me. Ever since we got married, all the fights you've had in this village are basically about me. So I was wondering maybe he has said something unpleasant about me to you that made you engage me in a fight. No, not at all. I would like to talk to you. I 
ce coup dans la montre est sorti. I really don't understand my husband. Have you ever kept a secret for so long that you got tired and feel like telling me? No. That is how I'm feeling now. There's this secret that I've kept for so long that I want to share with you. But I don't know how you're going to feel about it. Do you have another woman elsewhere? Talk to me, Udemba. Do you? Yes. I tried hiding it, but I cannot hide it anymore. Who is this woman? Do you want to know? Yes. Who is she? What? Udeba! Olive, I'm sorry. You have been dating for years. And she is pregnant for me. So, I brought her to live with us. You must be joking! No, he's not. I'm pregnant with his child. And I've come to stay. Yes, she's right. Oh lady, there is no water in that house. So take this pot, run down to the stream, fetch me some water. That's fast. I want to have my back. Oh lady, I believe I'm talking to you and you heard me. Oh lady, have you gone deaf or dumb that you can't even reply? Udemba! What is this, my lord? Oh. What is this? The water. You mean she has not gotten the water? No. Look at her there. Aledo. Aledo. What are you still waiting for before you go and get the water my dear wife demanded? Am I not talking to you? Aledo. Aledo. Am I talking to you? Look at her. 
temper. For the first time in eight years of our marriage, you fought against me. Hey, just shut up! Shut up and pick the pot. Go and fetch me some water. What are you still waiting for? Did you hear her? Now do just that. I will. Where are you going to? Where are you going to? I'm talking to you. Leave me alone, Ogoma. What is your problem? You are my problem. Really? Yes. Then allow me to leave the house for you. No way. There is no way. You are not going anywhere until you finish what I've asked you to do. Which is, you go in there, pack those plates I used to eat, wash it, arrange the house, make sure you clean it very well before you go out. Not until that, you are not stepping out. As your maid or what? Yes. Oledu, you are my mate. You are mad. Something is actually wrong with you here. Did you touch me? Did you just touch me? Do your worst. Do your worst. I am warning you, Ugoma. Leave me alone for the I last time. I won't leave you alone. I will not leave you alone. Or do you want to beat a pregnant woman? Because you don't know how it feels to be pregnant. Shame on you. Shame on you, Oledu. Do your worst. Do your worst. I'm waiting ha. for you. <laughs> I am waiting for you! I have tolerated this witch enough in this house. Whether I beat her or not, Udemba must definitely bounce on me whenever he returns and hear of what happened. Is it not better I deal with this fool and face the consequences than leaving her and still God beating? See, you're not going anywhere. Ugoma, I am warning you for the last time. Take your hands off me. I won't. All right. <laughs> Udemba! <laughs> Udemba, all that has killed me. <laughs> what is it? Why are you like this? Only though, only that has killed me. Why did she do to you? She beat me up. And she sent me out of the house. <laughs> she even tries to, to deal with you if you question her or challenge her about this. <laughs> you mean she did all this? Let me lie to you. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> only though, you have touched the doll of a liar. <laughs> Where is she right now? She's at home. Well, le let's go. Let's go. Sit up. Hey, Izzy. Oh, my body is paining me. To that extent. Oh. You need to see the big stick that you used to beat me. Stick it, what? The stick is very big. What, do, what about my child? I can't feel it anymore. Ah, it's moving. Ah, don't, don't, don't just say that. You mean my child is not moving? Oh. I'm finished. All right, though. Mm. Oh no! Mm. You, you are gone! She deserves to die! No! She doesn't! Leave me alone! Dima, stop it! Leave me alone! Dima, when have you passed to into a white bitter? Eh? I hope this you are beating this woman has nothing to do with this. This this bear yeah! Just stop it. Hold it there. I will not have you call my wife names. And for you, just thank your stars. Thank your stars and pray too. Pray that nothing happens to my wife and my urban child. Because if it does, I will make sure I bury you alive. Okay. I'm better now. Are you sure? Yes. Let's go inside. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's okay. 
<laughs> Stop crying, okay? It's alright. What do you do? Why don't you go inside, pack your things, and come with me? Come with you to where? To my house. I mean, our house. Or oh, haven't you noticed that you no longer belong here? I belong here. This house is my house. It is my husband's house and I will not leave. If there is anybody who should leave this house, then that person is your wife. So I advise you to go in there, bundle her out from this place. I love Odemba. I love him so very much. And I cannot tread him for anything. So go and take your wife and leave this house. Because I am not going to leave my husband. Nothing will make me to leave my husband. Not even in my grave. What? Excuse me. All you do. What are you doing here? Grandma. I've come to take you home. You do not belong here. Says who? Says me. Says me. Or have you forgotten that I am your husband? Hey, Goma. I married you as every other man marries their wives in this kingdom. I passed all due processes. I did all the necessary things to make you my legal wife. Goma. Come on, please. Come on, please. You know I love you so much. And I have equally forgiven all your past mistakes. Please, let's go home. Let's build a new home for ourselves, you come on. Please. No. I'm not going anywhere. I love Udemba so much. And I'm carrying his child. Look, he has equally promised to to, to, to return everything you spent during the time you came to marry me. Me like put to bed. So please, I will appreciate it if you leave me alone and start going home now. Because my husband will not find it funny when he comes back and meet you here. I see. I will go. I will go. But I will leave you with this. You continue staying here is at your own risk. Did you hear me? Oh yes, I will never, I repeat, I will never be pushed or held responsible for anything that will happen to you. As long as you continue staying in this house. For the last time I go, ma, let's go home. No, go. I'm not going anywhere. This is my home. Go, ma, let's go home. I'm not going anywhere. Let's go home. This is my home. Okay. If that is the case, this is your home. Enjoy your home. Enjoy your stay. How did it go? Oh, oh, she refused though. How do you mean she refused? You should have bonded her out with you. Olam, Ogoma is not a baby. She's old enough to know that the business she's trading right now will profit her nothing. Nothing. Wong, are you sure? You explained to Ugoma exactly what I told you. Exactly. Just the way you said it. I passed the message. Ugoma. I think I watching Tinaya sooner. They don't tell a deaf man that the war has started. Even when the bird starts flying without perching, the hunter learns how to shoot without aiming. Thank you. 
I shall be on the way. Olam, Are you not giving me something? Eh? You just find somewhere. Do let me please half round, half half. Eh? Uno kum nam pota. If you just put the cap, everything will come out. I will be free. Let us do small. Onyo Liana Abuoko, am I a choke? If you like. Stay here from morning till night, looking for a woman to sleep with. You will never get me. I am not interested. Or better still, go and get your wife to do that for you. Excuse me. Olam. Olam, small now, just little. Hi. Oh, did you send me a message? And you did not give me this thing. I have spoken to you as the mother, father, uncle, and aunt. I have also spoken to you like a brother, sister, friend, and even your best friend. I have sent people across to you, far and near, including work with your husband. Yet, you paid deaf ears to them. Now I am going to speak to you like an enemy. Ugoma! Do not be deceived by that thing in your womb. Go in there, back those racks you called clothes, and get out from this compound. As what? As you demba or what? As the rightful owner of this house, Mrs. Udemba. <laughs> You're very funny. And you know it. I am not joking with you. And if I don't, what will you do? Then you will not like what will happen to you next. Oledo. Oledo. Do your worst. I am waiting for you. Um, it's over a month now since my wife left me for Udemba. And ever since then, no day has passed without you coming to check up on me, to know how I'm doing. Even most times, get me something to eat. You deserve it. Thank you. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. You have a good heart. Yes. And you're equally a nice person too. Thank you. I want to tell you something. What? Okay. I just want to tell you to keep on being nice. Keep on being who you are. Hmm? That someday, your good heart will definitely land you to a king's palace. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, I have to go now.
Kom. 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 Are you okay? I had a scream. I had a dream. A dream? What about it? Come talk to me, what about it? Demba, what if I get pregnant now? <laughs> Gum, I used to ask him. I will just marry you. What about old lady? That one. What will happen to her? She will move in with Wonko. Besides, I'm suspecting that she's having something to do with your husband. Yes. Okay, now listen. Do you remember the other day that I was with you? When I got home, I couldn't find her. And when she finally returned, I asked her where she's coming from. Do you know what she told me? That she was bored at home and decided to come and stay with you. That she was with you all that day. Are you serious? Serious. That day. That day. <laughs> How's you doing, my friend? He's very fine. Uh, uh. Oh, Nne. You are back? Yes. Um, I was actually asking your husband about yes. you. How are you? I'm fine. I went to see my mother. Yes, he said that. How is she? She's doing very well. Thank you. All right. Um, I actually wanted to discuss something with you, but that would be next time because my husband will be waiting for me. How is Odemba? He's very fine. He sends his regards to you. All right. My greetings to him too. Okay. I will be on my way now. may be right. I suspected them that same day. But what if she refused? <laughs> refused key. Then she still become your maid. Are you sure? Yes. Are you sure? That was exactly what happened in the dream. But she almost killed me. And that was why I screamed. Is that why you're scared? Yes. You don't have to be. Because she can only try it in dream world. If she dares try it in this way world, let me not tell you what I will do to her. <sighs> Alright. So tell me, did you miss me? Ah, I missed you so much. Mm. What and what do you miss? Everything about you. Mm. Yeah. Now you know the things they miss about you. <laughs> <laughs> and I must confess, you're a very strong man. <laughs> and you're good at it. <laughs> not man. You just called me not a man? Mm. Spoiled you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. 
Look at her. Shameless woman. Ugoma, shameless woman. On on a day I saw this. Look at her. Look at you. Shameless woman. What is it? What is it? Why are you locking my way? You just leave my way. I won't. I won't. Tell me, Ugoma. What is it that you see in another woman's husband that you could not find in yours? I don't understand. <laughs> or are you trying to accuse me? Me, Equitos. I accuse you. Well, I saw you and him doing it. You're just very funny. <laughs> you saw who and who doing what? You and them by having sex. Me and Udemba having sex. Mm -mm. Cultivating cassava. No, 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 no. I'm very sure it's not me you saw. I'm very sure. Okay, tell me where and when. In the bush, under a tree, a while ago. May the gods forbid. It's not me you saw. How can I do such an abominable thing? Is my eyes deceiving me? Sure, it is. I've not even set my eyes on Udemba today. Not to talk of doing anything with him. If I really want to have sex, I'll go to my husband, not to Demba. They are equitous. If they sent you to me, go back and tell them that he's not seeing me. In a few one now, Oburogi no Demba come for us somewhere. Equitos is not me. Oburogi. Oburomua. Oku Oburogi. Oburomua! I'm so bad. Oku Oburogi. I'm so bad. Equitos, what are... Oku Oburogi. Are you leaving? Why wait to wait? Just wait for me, please. Keep on. Keep on. Keep on. Keep on. Keep on. Please wait now. Keep on. Keep on. Keep on. Ugoma. Ugoma, what is it? What? Why are you standing like this now? Why would I stand like that? All right. I'm sorry. Let's settle it here. Settle what? You said it was not you I saw. It's me. No, it was not you. And it can never be you. Besides, you have not seen Udemba today. It can never be you. Hi, you quit us now. What is it? <gasps> he said it's me. And I did it. You did it with him? Yes, I really. Yes. I really enjoyed it. Ah? I got the wine. Clap for yourself. Eh? Clap. I'm done, and I would like to eat something. You never told me that I'm going to pay you. Thought we agreed that you're going to make my hair five good times free of charge. Yes, you did. So why are you asking for money? Here, I never asked of money. I asked for food. Is it not money that I use in cooking the food? I still don't believe you're the one I saw. Oh, he said it's me. I swear by the gods, it's me. I think you are mistaken. I think you are mistaken. No. I just remembered. It's me. Yeah. So, please wait with us. I want to beg you for something. Don't tell my husband. I don't want to lose my marriage, please. Well, I was actually on my way to your house to tell your husband, Ryogo, what I just saw. But um, since you have uh, confessed your sins and you don't want him to know, right? Maybe I'll change my mind. But you have to do something. You have to give me 10 calories for shutting my mouth. 10 calories? Mm -hmm. That is too much money, uh -huh. a huge amount of money. Okay, no problem. Uh -uh. Put down. Uh, look at us. Uh, I will pay. Oh, it has to be in two days' time. Two days' time. And you will pay? I won't. You won't? Okay. Ten calories. Two days' time. If you pay, I'll tell your husband. Your husband. I'm going back.
You are not leaving this house. You are not going anywhere. Come back here, this man. You are Goma. not going anywhere. Goma, what kind of a woman are you? Eh? I just told you I don't have money. I want to make go. You don't have money, okay? Yes. You liar. You have money and you must provide me with the money. Yes, you are not leaving this house. Goma, leave me alone. Leave my clothes. If I don't. This woman, leave me alone. Hey! Ah! No sense. You just no. Please, man, that is the only thing you can do. Please, man. I. Oh, I regretted getting married to you. You fucked, eh? You are my greatest mistake. I caused the day I got married to you. <laughs> I, I wish I can turn the hands of the time. I would have rejected you both physically and spiritually. Fool, useless man. Don't worry, you can't come back and meet me in this house. You can't come back and meet me in this house. Kingdom. Handsome and energetic. <laughs> All this praise is for me. Hmm. Denver, you deserve it and even more. Denver, Ibo Gemogo. You help the women with that thing in between your legs. I have come that you may help me to make me feel like a woman. <laughs> What's a great surprise. A pleasant one for that. And a great offer from a beautiful maiden like you. But I cannot do what you want me to do for you. Why? Because I'm married. Oh. Uh. Hmm. I'm sure you wouldn't want your wife to find out that you slept with Tuguma. How did you know? Is that necessary? Just answer me. Yes, I wouldn't want her to know. Just what I thought. Please, don't tell my wife. Fine. Then let's make love. Please stop it. My husband may just walk in and he might see us. Eh, Mbano, eh, this go to our usual place. You know I've missed you now. You wanna go now? Hmm? I miss you too. That reminds me, where is the money you promised me? Eh, the money. I came with it now. I can't miss the money. This is the money. Hi. You are a darling. Hold on. You know, eh, see, I will do anything you want. Anything. I will do anything for you. In fact, I will stop at nothing until I make you my wife. Where she come? Please, you have to start going now. You don't have to take me back. But, well, um, I thought we were going together. Just go. I have something I'm doing. I'll meet you later. Okay? Uh, meet me. Are you sure? Because for no man, I'm I'm fine. Hold it right there. Don't just insult me. Do you think you're the only person that knows how to do it? Equitos, calm down. You'll fire May you. that calm down fire you. You will die. May that calm down fire you back, Goma. And don't forget that you're still owing me. Hey! How oh, Equitos has killed me. Oh, Dimba. I'm so ashamed of you right now. I should have known that you're a he goat. You don't have to be. She, she threatened to tell my wife that I'm having an affair with you. So are you not? Are you not to Demba? Eh? No, 
does not want to do it as well. What? If you come close to me, I will slap you ten times. Here goes. Come on, get out of my way. Because so tears will be there for young lady. <laughs> no problem. I'll come. I tell you. Don't disappoint me. Have I ever disappointed you before? Okay, that's good. I'll come. Ugomba, come here. Ugomba, come here. when you saw us and ran back. Is everything okay? <laughs> anyway, I was actually going to your house to inform you of my sister's wedding tomorrow. And I want you to come and help us. Oh, um, okay, I, 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 I will. But let me hurry home. I, I left something on fire. Goma, this is unlike you. Are you sure you are fine? I'm fine. I, I'm, I'm okay. I'm, I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Um, you have not seen anything yet. Keep running for your sin. Um, Ekwe. Mm -hmm. Don't mm -hmm. forget something. No okay. problem. I'll come. Mm -hmm. All right. Good. Recording. Oh, thank you. Oh. Oh. Udemba, my friend. Wagu. <laughs> Udemba, how are you? I'm fine. Wow. You're looking so good, so plumpy. <laughs> Thanks to the gods. The gods? Yeah. Or oh, from my friend, your wife. You know I gave you such a beautiful wife. Anyway, Udemba, how is she? <laughs> Lam is fine. I see. She's fine. So, where are you going? Yeah, I was actually going to check my trap. Yes, and you? I'm just coming from my farm. Okay, okay. Yeah. That means I'll see you later. No problem. Yeah? No problem. Um, and let's I forget. My regards to a lady. She will hear. Good. I don't blame you. Aledo! Aledo! Yes, my husband. I want you to tell me the truth. About what? Mogo. Is there anything going on between you and him? I don't understand. I mean, Guinea and May the gods forbid. Good. Henceforth, I don't want to see you close to him or his house. If you go want to see you, let her come here. Because from the way I'm seeing Mogo, he's like someone who can rape another man's wife. Please, my lord. Oh yeah. I would like you to avoid that man the way you avoid an enemy. Do you hear me? Yes, my husband. Why you keep away? And I want to do. Please. Just avoid him, eh? Just go in and get me something. Get me water. I want to eat as well. Rubbish. Work. The way you lay your mat. That is exactly how you lie on it. I know my wife is decent. Unlike that, your useless wife that has been chasing me up around the whole village.
Stop it! Hi. Well, I'm giving you. And so? Oh. So you think I don't know why you pressed me down to this place? Yeah, well, I know you know now, eh? See, you don't hungry me. Eh? This just do. This just have have this small eh? all the all the nampota. All the nampota, eh? This just have it. Hong. Eh? Are you this shameless? In an open place like this? No, we can't. See, no problem, eh? Here is an open place. And we just go down inside the bush. We just, we just have the oh. I said no. No way. Hold on. See, eh, I want you badly. So badly. In fact, I regret ever letting you go. It changes nothing. Leave me alone. Can't you just get it? Hey, hold on. How are you doing this now? Mm? Okay, you just have just picky, just small picky. Mm? Don't you get it? Not today. Okay, hold on. Just romance. Mm? Just. Mm -hmm. You never give up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, what a beautiful name. Thank you. Ahem, <clears throat> Uri, you are the most beautiful girl I have ever seen. Okay. But what is your own name? Oh, 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 oh. Pardon me, eh? Forgive me. Um, my name is Mwani. I'm from Mwani. Um, I would like us to go to Awani, Kaikawalan. Please, I don't understand. You don't understand? Yes. Ah. Um, come, let me show you. Let me show you. And Ogoma, where are you going to? How is that your business? You're asking me how is that my business? Have you forgotten that I am your husband? And I ought to know your whereabouts. Really? I'm old enough to take care of myself. Oh, really? Anyway. I am not stopping you wherever you're going to. Just go in there and get me something to eat. I am hungry. I doubt. If you are really hungry, you wouldn't be sitting here waiting for me to give you something to eat. You will go in there and prepare something for yourself. Besides, you've not given me the money I asked you for. Oh, is that it? Ask yourself. Goma, why are you so mean? Why are you so heartless, so wicked and irresponsible? I just told you, I am hungry. I am hungry. Go and get me something to eat. The good in no in the Imagine how she's looking at me. Eh? I can't do this. 
Uri. Uri. Uri, why are you sounding like this? Eh? Yeah, you can look over here and now. Why are you? Eh? Magazine. Why are you here? Why are you here? I like it. Eh? It will go around your whole body. Can me this say this one? No, so. Eh? Yes. Yes. Oh, yeah. Let me tell you. Hmm? It's just you are looking at me like this. Ihem bunuku. What I have in between my leg is acres. Oh, acres of land. Eh? Mwa. Chere kambu terigi yuketo. Oh, kambu terigi yuketo. Yes, Ekutos, what is it? You don't look happy. How can I be happy? How can all be well? When my wife I married with my own hand and money. She doesn't care about me at all. She doesn't even care about how I feel. Could this be the opportunity I have been looking for? When the going gets tough, the tough ones get going. I must utilize this opportunity. Ekutos, are you okay? Hey, I'm fine. Uh, what exactly is the problem? Food. Niono. Just food. Just food. I need something to eat. Is that the problem? That is the problem. That is not a problem. One. Um, what would you like to eat? Anything food. As long as it can pass through this truth, oh, yeah. I'm fine. Okay. You know what? Just give me some time. I'll be right back. Huh? I'll bring food for you. Ew! I didn't care for you. 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 Acres of land. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed, it is. <laughs> Do you want another one? Oh, this is what we want. Look, okay, to a. Come to love for me, bro. Wow, my favorite, <laughs> you darling. Hey, I thank you so much. I really do. But you see, before I start eating, I must apologize for the things I might have done wrong, like me and Ekutos. Yeah, it's all right. I've always known you to be a naughty man. And I have always known you as a spoiled woman. Oh no! <laughs> you spoiled me and you know it. I can never forget how it all started. I was actually on my way to see a friend the day our paths first crossed.
you were such a charmer. You did all you could to catch my attention. But I wasn't ready for you. After that day, you started trailing me everywhere I go. Humbly insisting to aid me with my work, even when I refuse, you never give up. Oh, how can I forget the day you ambushed me on my way back home? The same day I told you my name. Mmm, nothing baffles me more than how a person could totally trust a stranger and be so much transparent. It was more like I could read your mind just because you made it possible. You told me how much you loved and want to spend forever with me. You asked me to be your woman. Without a second thought, I accepted. You became so happy. And I felt like I was a queen ruling all over your world. And you hugged me. That was my first time to get so close to any man. You showered me with lots of gifts as though I was a princess. Wow, there is a special day in every woman's life. Yes. Mine is both special and memorable. The day you planted the seed of womanhood in me, you pranked me and I fell for it. Thought it was a big antelope, you said it killed.
little did I know that the antelope that was supposed to be lying dead in the bush was me. You grabbed me and pulled me to yourself. I couldn't place what was going on, but the smile on your face tells it all. You didn't only touch my body, you also touched my soul. I lost my strength as a young girl, and I fell for your charm. That was my first time, and I had no regrets. You undressed me, and you showed me the other antelope. Not even the pain that came with it can make me regret that fateful day. I saw with my eyes blood strolling down my legs and made its way down to the ground. It sank into the soil and I knew it, that I have been ushered into another world of new. The sun smiled at us. The tree danced for us. The bird sang sweet melodies to us. And I knew it, I just knew it, that I have been ushered into another world of me. I cried helplessly, but you consoled me and promised that you will never leave my side, that you will make me your bride, made me even stronger. All through that day, I couldn't stop thinking of the incident. How would I have forgotten such a wonderful memories? I was away, but I'm back to take what rightly belongs to me. You know that is not possible. The gods will make it possible. Udemba, you are mine, and mine alone. Nothing will separate us, not even all you do. Udemba, my body, spirit, so yells for you. wrong with you you've been smiling all to yourself and besides it took you so long to come in here is there anything i need to know mm. nothing let's go let's go now Go to the boom, okay. I did not keep any food in this house. And this one doesn't look like the food made here. Where did he get it from? <clears throat> Wago! Where did you get this food from? And how is that your business? It is my business. Because I'm the woman of this house. Oh. You are the woman of this house? Yes. And let me also remind you, when the woman of the house neglects the man of the house, she should not also forget there are many women outside there waiting for her to step out, for them to step in. Meaning? Meaning, use your tongue, count your teeth. 
I have some old wife. Please, can I ask you a question? Let's go ahead. Go ahead. Promise me not to get angry. I will add it on to you. I promise. I promise you. Oh. Why did you get married to me, knowing fully well that I had something to do with war in the past? Oledo, what kind of question is that? For your promise not to get angry. Not in an issue like this. Now for the last time. Are you seeing Mogo? No! I was just wondering. About what? Why you left to Goma to marry me? Tell me, do you still have feelings for her? And do you want to leave for Mogo? That doesn't answer my question. Do you still love Goma? Stop putting words in my mouth. Interesting. Thank the gods you're here. Oh, message came so urgent, so I have to hurry. I hope there is no problem. There is. And a big one at that. <gasps> You're getting me scared. What is it? My wife. Is she dead? What? Is something wrong with you or what? How would you wish my wife dead? I'm sorry. Sorry for yourself. Listen, you have to stop saying. <laughs> You're joking, right? See, I have never been this serious before. May I know why? Okay. My wife has started suspecting that we are having an affair. Somebody is feeding her about us. Equitos. I think I have to put an eye on my wife. It's so clear that she's still Mogo. Obvious that Udemba and Ugoma are having an affair. I don't need a soothsayer to confirm it to me. But what do I do? Should I confront Ugoma? Maybe I should confront her. No. Or maybe I should wait till I catch them red handed. What do I do? shouting at my name like someone who just got mad. Equitos is you that is mad. It is your late parents, your mother and your father. Oh, just hold this right there. 
I can endure any kind of insult from you. But what I cannot tolerate from you is involving my late parents. Now, what do you want? Equitos, I trust we had an agreement. Yes, and I have been maintaining it. Liar. If you do, how come only the find out that I'll be having an affair with her husband? She does. Yes. Well, I can't tell because I haven't said a word concerning you and the Dimba to her. But I am planning on doing that because you have refused to keep to your own part of the promise. Really? Yes. Fine. When you're doing that, mm -hmm. do not forget to tell her that you slept with him too. I'm very sorry. So mm. what kept you? My mother. Eh? I had to fetch some firewood for her before I start coming out. Mm. Oh, okay. So did you come with me? Mm. I did. Let me see. Mm.
You must leave. I will not leave this house. You must leave. You must leave this house. I am not leaving this house. You I will leave. not leave this house, Demba. This is my husband, sir, and I will not leave. Oh, you know that you have a husband and you went and be sleeping with another man? You equally know that you have a wife. Yet you move around the whole village, sleeping with other young ladies. Me, 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 You call me a he -goat. That is exactly what you are. A big he -goat. Chai. Mwago. 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 It's because of you, all of this insulting me. Calling me names. Mamumbi! Chaka Walum. How shameless can you be? How shameless can you be, too? Eh? So you now have the gods to talk back at me in my own house. So you don't know I am the man in this house? Being a man does not justify your sins, Wago. You cheated and I cheated too. Oh really? Oh yes. We are in this mess together. Okay. Since it has gotten to the point of challenge, now go into that hut, back to the last thing that belongs to you and leave my house. This minute. Oh, with our pleasure. What? Yes. And wh where are you going to? Where do you think you're going to? If you dare go into that hut, talk less of to come out with a single pin. What I will do to you, what I will do to you, you will not believe it. I'm not against you going. Please, if you want to go, just go the same way you came. Else, why am I even talking to you? This fight is not for me and you. It's I and Udemba. Between Udemba and then, um, what is that his name? My dear, I hear that they have been sleeping with each other's wife. Fiawa, hello. Do you know why your mouth take it easy? Bring down your voice. Do you, don't you know someone might hear you? Sorry, oh, it's an abomination now. Mm. My dear, that is what I heard. Be Kokwa, I did not tell you anything. The queen, have more queen here. I did not tell you anything, no. Huh. No wonder they've been running around trying to cut off each other's head with cutlass. Huh. Oh. Oh. What about their wives? Ijo Munjo. Eh? If you ask me, who will I ask? I beg, let's continue doing what we're doing, Joe. Show hmm. this thing. You! You too! This is the end of the road for you! And this is the end of the road for you too! Gets me scared. Is anybody after you? No, nobody's after me. Eh? Ah, you're scared though. So, why all this run? Haven't you heard? Eh? You want to tell me you've not heard? heard what? The latest, ne? Is what latest? About Udemba, Mwog, Ugoma, and the uh, Oled. What happened to them, please? Do you know that Igwe? Summon them to the village square tomorrow with their parents. What for now? Huh, I said, what for? I don't know. Hey. He even asked the villagers to be there too. Ne? Well, how serious it is? Hey. Then we shall be there to find out now. Everly, we will be there. I will see you later, won't huh. I? I will see you later. Oh 
hungry. Oh? I'm still wondering. Wondering? Yes. Wait, oh. Don't tell me you're wondering about what just happened at the village square right now. It is. How can the Ingwe, the elders, and the both families of Olede, Udemba, Ugoma, and the uh, Wongo mm. agree to such decision? It's a hard one, you know. Huh. It is not. To me, it's the best decision ever made in the history of our time. Honestly. Eh? Watching those two men kill themselves would have been the worst thing. But you know, ah, see, now that the problem has been settled and everybody's happy, it's okay like that. Besides, Oledo and Wongo, they were lovers. Same as uh, Ugoma and the, what's his name again? Um, Udemba. Eh? Before they got married to each other. Eh? So what else? I don't know what you're talking about again. Eh? But Oledo says not to be happy. This is how she was hurried off immediately the decision was made. My dear, I saw that. I think her heart belongs to Demba. But I know with time, she will learn how to love and live with her. Uh, now. You think so? I know so. Ruina, if not that I was dead, I would have believed that such a thing could happen. Hmm. Seriously. Thank the God that you were dead. In the guy for you Oh. Sorry. Hey. That's my lot. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> wow. I'll catch you finally. <laughs> Ugo. Hello. In a way, Jolo. Oh, you, you. Mwam Jeko. Her name. My love. Now that you're mine. See, I promise that nothing will ever separate us again. Yes. I may not love you forever. But I will love you from now. See, death do us part. Again, I promise to be a lovely husband to you. And a wonderful father to our unborn children. Hmm. And I promise never to leave your side again. I promise to be a good and a faithful wife to you. To do you good, not evil, all the days of my life. You darling. <laughs> wow, thank you very much. I love you for that. I love you too. What? Now that you don't have to hide and do it, why don't you have one here? In this open place? Uh -uh. Doesn't matter. It's just me and you. I'm shy. You don't have to be. Uh -oh. Hold on. 
Man, I've been searching for you everywhere. And here you are, Moody. Worrying yourself to death. And what is it? You and I know that getting yourself worried will never solve any problem. Instead, it will cause more harm to you. And you know it. Hold on. Hold on, please. I love you so much. You have to stop worrying yourself. I beg you. See, I want you to understand that whatever the ghost did not know does not happen. And I strongly believe that it's their wish for us to live like husband and wife. And please, I want you to accept this fate. Let's live like one. Please, I promise to worship you. I promise to love you, cherish you, adore you all the days of my life. Yes, Olam, please. Let's go home and be happy together. Please. Wait now, stop, 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 stop. <laughs> You're welcome mm. to my home. Mm. <laughs> and the gods. Oh. So you're all mine now. Come again, come again, come again. Oh. And oh. the gods. Stop, 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 stop. Get it, get it, get it. Just come, let's go inside. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, no, 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 no. Okay. No, no, no. Olam, for how long shall you continue like this? Eh? For the past three days now, you've not eaten anything, nor even drink water. Udemba and Ugoma has moved on with their lives. By accepting the decision that was made by the kingdom and their parents, even your own parents and mine, I am not part of that decision. Olam, even if you're not, I want you to always remember that the ways of the gods are different from ours. Yes. Olam, please forget about Udemba. Let's move on with our lives. Just as the gods has chosen. And I promise you, our future will definitely be better than theirs. Eh? Okay, tell me. What can I do to make you happy? Just tell me. Mention it. Take me back to Demba. Take me to my husband. Olam, I wish that is possible. I would have done that. Because your happiness is all that matters to me than anything else in this whole wide world. Then leave me alone. Leave me alone, Wog. Seriously, if only though she continue acting this way in the next few days, Wog will chase her out of the house and marry another. He will do no such thing. Yes. He respects and loves Oledo. 
more than we could ever imagine. <laughs> Even at that, it's almost three weeks now and she's yet to forget what happened. Ego, it's not as easy as you think. Yes, but I pity that poor girl. But she needs to forget the past and embrace the future. She will. She will. Oh, I appreciate you too. Please hurry up with the hair. I need to go and fetch water before night falls. I will do that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Bro. bro, leave me. I'm not leaving you alone. Leave me alone. Come here. This nonsense has to stop. It has to stop. Eh? Olindo, we are supposed to be living like husband and wife. Not like brother and sister. Husband and wife do vertical everything together. They sleep together. They bath together. They discuss together. They sit together. Sometimes even die together. But our case is different. It's the opposite. It's either we remember this, in the morning we remember. We remember that, in the afternoon we remember. In the evening we remember. What is it? If I'm doing the way you're doing, do you think you want to stay? No, you tell me, do you think you would want to stay? In fact, I am tired of this thing called marriage. Then call it a queen! What? Yes, take me back to my parents! <laughs> Laughing at us, Holly, though. I don't care. All I said is that you should take me back to my parents. Hold on. Hi. Autumn. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for shouting at you. Eh? Well, you know I love you so much. Eh? I can't take you back to your parents. Eh? Okay, fine. See, I promise. I will never ever shout at you again. I promise. Eh? Hold on, please. Please. Leave me alone! Hi. Hey. 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 This one you are just happy, what is it? My husband, hmm? if I tell you what I saw today when I was coming back from where I went to, you will laugh to eternity. Hmm? I'm telling you. That's interesting. Very, very interesting. Can you just tell me I'm all ears? Oh, my husband, mm -hmm. as I was coming back, mm -hmm. I passed through Mogo's house. I saw him and all lady fighting and trying to tear themselves apart. <laughs> I told you. You see, when I was telling you that Mogu and Oledo cannot live together as husband and wife, did you believe me? Mm. No. Thank the ghost that you have seen it yourself. I did, though. Let me ask self. Mm -hmm. What is it that Oledo saw in you that she can't let you go? <laughs> I don't know. For me, if they want to kill themselves because of me, they should go ahead and do so. Mm. I'll be there to give them a befitting burial. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh
What are you trying to do? Let me sweep. Oh, please. You want to do the sweeping? Yes, I promise to take care of you. Eh? Let me sweep. Okay. Sweep then. Thank you. Seriously, I'm happy for them. Didn't I tell you? Huh? Eh, hey, Mimi. Do you know what has been happening in Odimba's house? Huh? Happening kwa? Yes. Urena. Urena. What is it? The wind of change has blown. Udimba and Ugoma that used to love themselves so much. Huh? He is now killing each other because of their inability to bear children. Ah, mm. So who is the cause of the problem? I wouldn't know. Mm. Hmm. They keep blaming themselves. Mm. If it's not Ugoma saying it's Udemba, it is Udemba blaming Ugoma. These days, if they are not fighting, they will be quarreling. Mm. Oh, now wow. Hello. Hmm. Olam. 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 What kind of stupid sleep was I sleeping when my beautiful wife stepped out of this house? I did not even know. Eh? Ooh. Hi. Olam, where are you? My beautiful wife, my beautiful Ola, where are you? I just told you the truth. I just told you the truth. Guma. Are you not to Demba? You are the one bad, Ugoma. You are the one infected. After all, you were married to Wogo for five good years. I will say, but he couldn't give him a child. <laughs> Look at who is talking. Hey! Look at you! Do you have any? No. Not even an imbecile. Yes! You were married to Oledu for good eight years! You know she had miscarriage. Hey! <laughs> when? Where? You know, if not, I would have been father of two by now. Ah, father of two indeed. Do not forget I know your stories. I know your stories. The same way a child knows the breast of his mother. Oh, Demba, you are a liar. I don't even know why I left to work on my lovely and caring husband for a selfish man like you. At least by now I would have been pregnant for him. Stay with you. Pregnant? <laughs> wait, wait. Let me ask you something. Do a man get pregnant? <laughs> Do a woman make a woman pregnant? Child. The mistake I made. Child. The mistake I made. Don't go and look for the solution to your problem. Stay here and be making noise. Important man. Excuse me. Olam.
Why are you doing this to yourself now? Eh? Why are you doing this to yourself? Eh? Why are you stressing yourself? I'm my unborn child. No, I am not. I'm only exercising myself. But I don't know. you know that a pregnant woman needs exercise? I know. I know all that. I know exercise of a pregnant woman, not as going to fetch firewood, fetching water, cooking, or even sweeping the compound. I've told you time without number, leave those works for me. I can do it myself. And I will do it myself. Or have I not been doing it the way you want? Yes, my love, you are. But. No, but. Okay? I know you must be tired. Let me carry you home. No, I can walk down the house myself. No, my love, I say no to that. Let me carry you home. No. And I insist on that. I must carry you home. No. It is now obvious that the cause of their childlessness is neither from Udemba or Uguma. You are right, my dear. But the question is, who exactly? Hmm. Mm. Time will tell. This your pampering is becoming too much and I won't take it anymore. I insist. I disagree. Okay, fine. Well, last time. This was the same thing you said the other day, but you never stopped. No. Okay, fine. For the very last time, it won't happen again. Are you sure? Very sure. All right, let's go. Don't it is I know. Okay, You must leave my house because I'm bringing in a woman, a real woman. I cannot continue to live in this house with a fellow man as a wife. Then why you lie? Hmm? Really? Yes. Leave my house. I'm not going anywhere. Udemba, I will live and die right here. For the sake of the gods, Udemba, I'm not the cause of your predicament. I'm a fertile land. And any seed planted in me grows. Mm. I'm a good farmer with lots of good seeds. And any land I cultivate on bring forth good harvest. With my good seeds, I have cultivated on you severally. But no harvest seems to be coming forth. Then you need to examine those your seeds very well mm. to make sure they are good as you claim. Mm. Now listen, I have done that months ago and it brought forth a good result. A result? Yeah. What result? Show me. Show me. I'm sure you don't like to see it. Of course I want to see it. Mm. Yes. Here she comes. Demba, hmm? don't tell me this is true. Oh yes, it is, my dear. It is true. Try the mistake I made. Don't go and look for the solution to your problem. Stay here, be making noise. Important man. Udemba, why are you sitting here all by yourself? Is everything okay? Yeah, good night. Hmm? Can I ask you something? Oh, yes. Am I truly an impotent man? I, I wouldn't know. Why did you ask? My wife called me one. Said I should go and look for solution to my problem. 
that's why I'm here in search of one. Weren't yourself here? No. I'm just thinking of the best harbour man to visit. Do you know one? Uh, um, yes. You know? So, how can we go there? Uh, can you take me to that place? Please, don't say no. Please, just take me to that place. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, come with me. Okay, okay. What I asked you was to take me to a harbour person's home. But I did. By bringing me to your house and lured me to heaven? Don't be in a hurry. Just give it some time and you will find the reason why I showed you the other harbour person. Soon, you will find the seed you just planted in me. Green. You don't... If that doesn't happen, then you will know that you are indeed important. Yes. Alright. I have to leave now. What if I get pregnant for you? I will make you my wife. And Ugoma? I will put her away and marry you. Okay. Very well then. This is the opportunity I've been waiting for. But what if he is truly important? Equitos, please, I would appreciate if you take me to this harbour person place right now, or I will go looking for one myself. Why can't you be special, Zidemba? Good farmers, they say. Always waters that which they have planted and patiently wait for it to spring forth. But in your own case, it's totally different. I have been patient ever since Ugoma became my wife. But he did. There's nothing to show for it. The earlier I start looking for solution to my problem, just like she said, the better for me. Else, I will live and die in this world without an heir. No, you won't. At this point? Yes. You know what? What? Come. Come on, what are the seeds you planted? Come.
No. She can't continue playing me. I can't continue to die inside. Not anymore. It's either Equitus take me to the harbor person she told me of, or I go in search of him myself. Equitus, yeah. how can you be this wicked? Three weeks is gone already, and you're telling me to be patient. Till when? No, no, no. Is it not obvious that I'm important? What do you want me to do now? Just take me to the harbor man you told me of. Okay. Now! Okay, I'm coming. Are you okay? I'm, I'm feeling somehow. I think I'm having fever. Fever? You need to see my madam. Uh, probably. Excuse me. <coughs> Take it easy. Mm. What kind of malaria is this? <coughs> It is not sweet, what I'm thinking. Equitas. Hmm? Three weeks pregnant. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. That is not true. <laughs> you are not important at all. The seed you planted in me has started growing. And soon, you'll be a father. No, come, come, come. Hey. <laughs> Let it go. Of our land be free. I said it. I said that this kind of fever. Equus, you don't look happy. What is it? You said that if I get pregnant for you, that you will marry me. Uh -huh. But I am pregnant already, and you haven't said anything about it. That has not changed. You have to give me a little time. Checks away that wicked and barren woman that calls her name Ugonjo or whatever. Then I will come and marry you. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. But I am not going to wait for too long. Else I will terminate this pregnancy. Oh! Oh! Please, don't just go there, please. I beg you in the name of the gods. Please, don't just go there, please. I beg you. Leave me. Equus. Equitas. Where? Where? Ugoma. 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 Yana. Yana. Ugoma. Ugoma. Thank you. Ugoma. 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 You will come back and meet me in this house. My husband, you called me. I've told you time with that number to stop calling me your husband. But you wouldn't listen. That's by the way. I want to tell you something very important. I don't know and I don't care on how you're going to feel about it. I just want to inform you that I'm no more interested in our marriage. What? You heard me clear. I give you three days. Just three days to pack all your belongings 
and leave my house. You must be out of your senses. Me? Mm -hmm. Out of my senses? Yes. I must be out of my senses. Right? <laughs> You have to give me a little time. More time. What more time are you asking for Udemba? Three days. You told me that Ugoma will be leaving your house in three days. Now it's months and she's still living in your house. I can see that you still love and want her as a wife. No. It's you I want. And it's you I love. Then what is she still doing in your house? Maybe you think I am joking, eh? No, please. You have to just take the sense. You just you have to just You think I am no, joking? No, no, no. No, Udemba, leave me alone. No, no, no. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. <laughs> Let me alone. Why do you want to stab yourself and our own child to death? <laughs> Let me alone. It is unfair. <laughs> All right. All right. She will live today. I must make sure she do. Yes. Let her live with them. <laughs> yes, she will. Okay, let's go to the house together so that you will watch me chase her away. I'm not going anywhere with you. If you have to go with me. <laughs> Because I cannot leave you alone at this point. Please. Yes. I wouldn't want anything to happen to you. No, our unborn child. Please. Just let's go. Please. Please. Follow me. It's okay. Stop crying. Stop crying. Barren woman? Deba, I am not barren. You are the one that is important. Mm. Yes. Now listen. Go in there and pack all your belongings and leave my house. Right now, or I'll force you. <laughs> you lie, you Deba. I am not moving an inch from this house. I will live and die with you here. May the gods forbid. May the gods forbid. It will never happen. Are you still waiting? Doing? Deba, you must leave this house today. That is, that is my clothes. Your clothes. What are you doing? You must leave this house. Take back my clothes. Take it this way. Take you, back my clothes. You must leave this house today. I'm not going anywhere. I'm bringing in a woman. A real woman. Because I cannot continue to live with my solo man as a wife. Nice one. So you've been cheating on me all along. Yes, just to show you that I'm not impotent as you think. Really? Yes. Then it has to be with this cheap prostitute. Ah, uh, don't just go there. How dare you call my wife a cheap prostitute? Huh?
Yes, she has given birth to a bouncing baby boy. What? Yes, my wife giving birth to a bouncing baby boy. Hey, the God of my ancestors, the God of my forefathers. May you be praised. He said, May you be praised. He said, let's go. Yes, let's go. 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 